Boxer engines are the most balanced engines to exist as the opposite cylinders counterbalance each other's vibrations. Despite this huge benefit, engine manufacturers don't tend to choose this configuration due to its high cost and sometimes tricky packaging. Although you may think you know many of them, this list can convince you otherwise. Porsche PFM 3200 Porsche Flugmotoren That's what the PFM acronym stands for. In 1981, Porsche decided to re-enter the aviation market. The 3.2-liter six-cylinder was a recreated variant of the Porsche automobile engine. They also made a 240-horsepower turbocharged version. Honda Valkyrie Six-cylinder in a motorcycle is a rare sight and Honda is one of those who made more than one or two. Sourced from the GL 1500 Goldwing, they tuned the Boxer 6 with six individual carbs and new camshafts. The engine's dynamics were improved and a reduction in the bike's weight was present. Subaru EZ30 The Subaru EZ30 six-cylinder engine itself was introduced in 1999, but its most powerful variant was used in the Legacy 3.0R from 2003. They later used it in the wagon body, the Outback 30R and Tribeca as well. It is known by its exceptional great sound, which is reminiscent of a Jay-Z at low revs and a Porsche at high RPM. <coughs> Porsche 914 6 Originally developed by Volkswagen and Porsche together, the 914 was meant to replace the Kamen gear and 912. None of the engines were new, they were only reworked old ones. You may have not known that there was also a 6 cylinder 914 6 engine installed in it, of which only 3300 examples were sold.
Subaru ER27, produced for only four years. The ER27 was specially developed from the four-cylinder EA82 engine. This flat six powered Subaru XT6, sold as LC1 VX in Japan, and was placed about the 115 horsepower turbocharged EA82 T version. In the following year, it was succeeded by the SVX's EG33 power unit. Franklin O335. The O335 engine was a variation of Franklin's two and four cylinder boxer engines, 2A4 and 4A4. The unit was normally mounted vertically in helicopters, for instance such as the Bell 47. The O335 had plenty of variations, the most powerful provided as much as 260 horsepower at 3400 rpm. Porsche 911 GT1 Created simply for the GT1 series, a street version was required in order to comply with the regulations. This brought many amazing and ridiculous looking sports cars to the world, like the 911 GT1 Strassen version. While this variant was detuned, racing spec car had over 600 horsepower. <laughs> Lycoming 0435. The name of the Lycoming 0435 may seem very similar to the Franklin 0335, however they are not related. One thing in common would be the usage. The Lycoming unit was also used in the Bell 47 helicopter, though the 0435 is a larger and lacks force induction. It appeared in the airplanes too. Chevrolet Corvair The Porsche 911 is the most popular representative of a rear-engine car, although some may still not know that the Chevy Corvair brought the air-cooled rear-mounted flat 6 layout even sooner than the German sports car. The Chevy Corvair also featured turbocharged version. The only major difference between this and 911 would be the valve train system. <laughs>
Tucker 48. Do you still remember the Franklin 0345? Preston Tucker, the guy who created the outstanding Tucker 48, used that engine for his car, turned it into a water-cooled unit and eventually bought a Franklin engine company as he liked the engine so much. Tucker 48 also featured the rear-mounted flat 6 layout long before Corvair or 911, but it was more like a luxury car with incomparably higher weight.